Miss Chu, we're going to push in a PCA pump. Give you some morphine, which should help control the pain. Thank you. But there's a greater problem here. I'm just taking a look at your MRI. Oh, no. Why didn't you call us before coming down here? I'm sorry. These are my parents. What's going on? I was just about to explain that Anna's MRI has shown that she has a mix of papillary pneumoma. It's a tumor in her spinal canal. But the good news is that we can't operate. You have a 95% chance of fully recovering if we get you in the surgery as soon as possible. And we can't wait another moment with a tumor this aggressive. Even waiting another day puts you at risk for permanent paralysis. Father? No. No surgery. Mr. Chu, without surgery, Anna will be paralyzed probably within the next 24 hours. There'll be no surgery today. We're taking her home. Anna needs the surgery. But she can have it at another time. Look, Mr. Chu, we I We are think... taking our daughter home. Anna, you're over 18. You don't need your father's consent. I'm Meng, and my father is the elder. If he says I go home, I go home. Contact social services, see if we can get somebody down here and talk to him. Do I continue to process? Unless you'll have to sign an AMA form stating that you're leaving against medical advice. Fine. I know this is new and confusing. I called a social worker and she's willing to come down and talk to you Spare and explain. Me. The white girl cultural divide love. I grew up down the street from here. I play in a band. I went to UW. I get it. But my father doesn't. He says no. It's no. We're talking about your ability to ever walk again. That's what you're talking about. I'm talking about my family. Have you ever even heard of the Hmong people? Our religion has got rules that are way old and way set in stone and way spiritual, and you don't mess with them. You don't anchor the ancestors. Even if you pierce your tongue and play in a band. What are the rules exactly? Anna needs to have her soul's intact before she has surgery. She needs a shaman. You could have told me that. Why? So you could call me a fool? I respect that you have traditions that I can't understand. But you're standing beside me in a $3,000 suit, so I also know that you respect the fact that I'm telling you Anna needs a surgery in the next 24 hours if she's going to continue to walk. She can't leave this hospital. She can't undergo surgery without her soul. She died. All right, then. We're just going to have to get a shaman today in the hospital. Shamans are listed in the yellow pages. Our shaman is 500 miles from here. You are an arrogant man. No. I'm just a guy with access to a helicopter. Thank you. Finding her soul won't be easy. It never is. The healing ritual. Are you okay with that? I can't find my soul if I'm medicated. No pain, no gain, right? Well, it's not just for your father. You believe it too, right? I know it sounds like a load of crap, but watch the ritual, you'll see. See what? The moment it happens, 